everybody in today's video i just want to show you some recent purchases that i've made like at the drugstore tj maxx stuff like that of polishes um i haven't really been ordering indies or ordering like ppu and stuff like that just because i haven't been painting my nails and so there's been stuff that's caught my attention but i'm like you're not painting your nails but when i go into like a drugstore or like walmart it's a little bit harder to resist because it's right there <laughs> and it's not as expensive so i have picked up a few things um and i want to share them with you so um i got a couple of polishes um at tj maxx recently and marshall's so i got these three opis um this first one is called o Okra the Moon or something like that. That's how I'm gonna or I hate when they <laughs> make the polish name so weird I don't know what it is. Okra the Moon, something like that. Anyway, it's sort of like a baby poop yellowy green, which you guys know anything baby poop, sign me up. <laughs> Um, and then I'm just going to do a little swatching on the nail wheel for you guys just so we can kind of see what we think it's going to look like. Oh, you guys, this has a good formula. And it's really, really ugly. Like, <laughs> prugly. Pretty ugly. When I was little, my grandpa used to tell me, you're so pretty. And I'd be like, thank you, grandpa. And then he'd be like, pretty ugly. <laughs> I don't know what made me think of that. <laughs> and then I would be like... And then you'd be like, I'm just kidding, mijita. And I'm like, no, you're not. <laughs> anyway, maybe that's why I like Prugly so much. Um, But there's one coat of that. And then um, I'll go ahead and two coat it. And we'll come back and look at it a little better. But that went on really smooth. And you guys, oh, that is so like baby poop, baby puke. Love it. Um, Next one from OPI is called My Dog Sled is a Hybrid. So I never got this when the original collection came out and I see a lot of people like post um, swatches of it and I've, I have kind of always wanted it. And so when I saw it at Marshall's, I was like, oh, and so I bought it. And I just think it's a really beautiful teal color, which I enjoy. And um, I just think that it's really pretty and I'm excited to add it to my collection. And I could see myself wearing it in the spring and summer. Again, this went on really smooth. And you guys, look at how pretty that looks. These actually look really pretty together, don't you guys think? I do. Gorgeous. Um, and then this pink is called Strawberry Waves Forever. I don't know what collection this is from, but it's like a beautiful shimmery sort of like pinky red. Um, There's a song, but it's not Strawberry Waves. It's Strawberry Fields Forever, right? Like the Beatles? Is that the Beatles? So I'm not sure what this is in reference to, like to even try and figure out what kind of collection it would be from. But you guys, oh, look at that. That is gorgeous. The shimmer really stands out on the nail too. Sort of like a glass flecky type of finish. That is super pretty. Then... I was on the hunt for uh, these Salon Perfect Limited Edition Halloween polishes. Look at how cute that is. It has like a little skull hand holding a rose, very romantic. Um, but I could only find one. <laughs> By the time I realized there was a collection and it was limited edition, um, I went online and they were all sold out. So this is the one I got. Um, so this one is called A Lover's Revenge. And it's very pretty. It's sort of giving me every month is Oktoberfest vibes from OPI. And let's see how it looks on the nail. I hate that these Salon Perfect limited edition things are getting kind of hard to find too. Um, like they don't, they're not in every Walmart, which is annoying to me. Like my Walmart hasn't gotten any of these limited edition collections in a minute. And I usually have to go to a Walmart out of town. Sometimes they don't even have it. And I'm just like, why? Why? Like, do you not want money? <laughs> I don't understand. Um, so this is obviously going to need a few more coats. But it has like a very darkened black, like a black base with some red shimmer. Um, we'll have to see how that builds up. It is sheer. Um, and then I was looking for Christmas gifts for my coworkers at Ulta 
and I ended up running across these Nailtopia Disney polishes. Um, so my friend is super into Disney. She gets all the Dooney and Burke Disney purses. And so um, I ended up getting her the Princess Jasmine, which was a really beautiful purple. And then I ended up getting me the one with Ursula on it from The Little Mermaid. But you guys, this is just like a perfect grandma shade. Um, I'm sure I have several other polishes like this, and I'm sort of just like a sucker for the packaging <laughs> at this point. But I've never tried this brand. Oh, it has a very nice wide brush. I've never tried this brand before. Let me know if you guys have and what do you think. But I'm a sucker for this wide brush. Um, Let's see. Let's see if I could show that to you a little bit better. Gorgeous. Um, total vampy grandma. That is, look at how pretty that is. Um, a little bit, it's definitely gonna be a two quarter on the nail, but super pretty. And um, does it have a color? Just says Ursula Limited Edition, so that's the name. Then, um, I didn't realize it, but <laughs> Salon Perfect came out with a Wonka collection and China Glaze came out with a Wonka collection. And it makes sense because China Glaze makes Salon Perfect, in case y'all didn't know. But, I don't know. Do we need this much Wonka in our life? I'm not a big Willy Wonka fan. I'm not a big, um, like the movies. Eh, not, I'm, I'm not the biggest fan. It's not my favorite. So I was kind of like, do we need this much Wonka in our life or could someone have given us something different? But I found two of the Salon Perfects that I liked and then I got one from the China Glaze collection that I liked. But now that I'm looking at these, I kind of, they're not similar. This is obviously green, this is teal, but they are similar, right? A little bit. <laughs> and then I picked up this one because it was sort of like a shimmery grandma, which you guys know how I feel about that. And so I guess let's watch this one first. This one is called Anything is Possible. And this again is from the Salon Perfect one. Uh, there was a couple other shades in the Salon Perfect one. I ended up seeing most of the collection. I think one bottle, I can't open this. I think one bottle was sold out, um, but the rest were available. Oh my gosh. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to swatch this. I literally cannot open it. Opening polish bottles and like food jars is definitely one thing that I miss about having a man live with me. <laughs> this is about one of the only one things, but it is one. Um, and so let's let's swatch this. Oh, you guys, I am obsessed with this. This makes my heart very happy. It's like a grandma with glitter and being that I am a grandma to be, <laughs> I, oh, this is pretty. I really like this one. Look at how pretty that is, you guys. That is some glowy goodness. I wish my nails were a little longer right now, but they're not. Um, and then we'll do the other Salon Perfect Wonka, which is called Hover Chalk or Hoover Shock. I don't know. Anyway, it's a green with shimmer. It looks really pretty. A lot easier to open, thank God. <gasps> Ooh, this is pretty too. I like that the shimmer on these is, is pretty visible, like it doesn't totally disappear. And I really like this like base color. It's very pretty. Look at that, you can see the glow, very gorgeous. And then from the China Glaze, this one is called Noodle. I saw this at, I wanna say CBS, and it was like the one that really caught my attention and I was like, well, you can have one. I'll allow one. <laughs> it's like talking to myself like I'm a two year old like oh but I want them all but then to myself I'm like you can have one and that's how I um, try to be a responsible adult I'm like you, you're allowed one and then I tell myself okay <laughs> um, but anyway look how pretty that is too so they are 
They're similar, but they are different, says the crazy nail polish person. So let me second quote all of these and then we'll come back and we'll take a little look. Okay, so everything has been double coated. Um, and the first one again is going to be Orch the Moon, Orcha, Orca. I don't know. Anyway, it's this very beautiful Prugly. You guys, OMG. That's probably not that good on my skin tone, but I don't care. That's like baby poop, baby threw up all at once on your nails. Once I have my grandbaby, I'll have to wear this because in case the baby happens to get poop on my hand. <laughs> I'm like, no, no, it's just my polish. That is so pretty, you guys. Oh my gosh, love. Next up is going to be Uh, next up is going to be my dog sled is a hybrid um i really love this one you guys look at how pretty that is i love that on my skin tone it seems like it's gonna have a really good formula i could see this as a pedicure as well i really love that it's beautiful this pink um is so nice as well and this is strawberry waves forever and I feel like it looks a little more red on camera than it really is in person. It's definitely pink and it has some really beautiful glow. I don't think my camera's gonna let it like show, but it's gorgeous. Um, what you see in the bottle of that glow is definitely on the nail. It's sort of like a goldenish pink glow. It's really pretty. And like I said, sort of like a glass fleck finish. That is beautiful. Um, this next one is very sexy vampy vibes. This one again was the lover's revenge from the salon perfect Look at how dark I didn't expect that to come out as black. Oh You guys That started giving me like um, like a Marticia Adams kind of feel Oh, I need to wear that. That is oh, I'm obsessed. I wish my nails were longer like that's not gonna look as good on a little nub Man, that's beautiful. It's very glowy. Oh, what else do I got here? Then I went with the Nailtopia Ursula. This is really pretty too. Just like a very chic grandma. Vampy grandma. Morticia Adams grandma kind of thing. It's beautiful. Um, this one I think could benefit from a little bit of top coat, which I don't have and I'm too lazy to get up and get, but this was the anything is possible from the Salon Perfect. And I think it's pretty, it's giving me some nineties vibes here and I'm, I'm here for it. The glow is beautiful. I just feel like a top coat would make it a little bit more obvious, but like I said, I'm a little too lazy for that right now, but very pretty. And then the other Wonka is going to be Hover Shock or Hoover Shock. And again, um, this could benefit from some top coat, but it has a really gorgeous glow. I really love that. It's super, super pretty. And I think out of all the Wonkas, this one is my favorite. This one is Noodle. It just has, I like the base color a little bit more than this one. And the glow is a little bit like more, I don't know, it's pretty though. Look at that, gorgeous. So, um, this is everything that I've sort of just happened upon in the stores <laughs> that I've decided to pick up. There's been a few things like I've wanted and I've just put back because I'm like, you are not painting your nails. Stop. Um, but the nail polish lover always wins <laughs> and the inner child that has to get yelled at always wins. Um, but let me know if you have any of these polishes. Did you manage to get your hands on more from this collection than I did? Because it looks really pretty and I'm kind of sad. I might look on like eBay or something for it or that Mar Marcari and see if I find some more. Um, but let me know if you have any of these polishes. If you do, what are your thoughts? What have you been picking up at the drugstore? Anything exciting you've seen um, that you've decided to get your hands on? Did you get anything from Wonka's collection? Either Wonka. 
um and that's it if you guys like this video please make sure to click the like button down below if you have not subscribed to my channel please do and thanks you guys for watching i will see you all in the next video i hope you're having an amazing day bye